Ronnie Vizier with a review of, um, well, just watched of uh, Log Horizon Season 1 and 2. Uh, because I don't think I did one for Season 1. Uh, do you remember that? I don't think so. Yeah. Um, these are freaking great. It's taking the concept of someone stuck in a game, which I basically only seen before in La in uh, Sword Art Online, I think. Uh, though it's a concept like I'm knocked around in my head a lot myself. Um, it's beautiful. It's well animated. It got Chekhov's gun to the freaking T. Especially in season one, you'll see the pattern of they'll set up a system in like episode, let's just say episode one. They set up like a system, they explain, okay, in uh, a standard encounter, just setting up a thorn bind hostage or something. Uh, my coming in crazy. Carry. Jesus! He's carrying us of a giraffe. <laughs> Seriously? That's the... Okay, I didn't get a view, but that's the screen we're in on. Okay, so, um... Yeah, you'll set... He's something like Thornbine Hostage, a spell. Set them in episode one. Episode two... You no, know, whatever. Episode 3, it pays off in a big way. And to me, that's really great. And it's not always like, you know, three episodes, but it usually has that pace. And considering these are uh, 25 episode seasons, you'll see two major arcs in each season. Uh, and still, you know, they, pay, they do payoffs. It's definitely something you need to pay attention to. It's not something that I'd recommend multitasking with. Uh, it's a beautiful show. It got great writing. And what can I say? This is definitely a 9 out of 10. A very strong 9 out of 10 watch show. Though... No, I can't really think of any reason not to watch this. <laughs> Go watch it! Why are you watching this video? Go watch it! 